On day one, I walked in the door of Greg Kopp's office. He's the finance director at Lakeland Union High School. And essentially, we spent a half hour talking about legislation and kind of a new funding opportunity that the district had to take care of some deferred maintenance needs. We found out about Act 32, and as I found out more about it, I talked to more superintendents about what's the benefit of Act 32 for buildings like what we have, older buildings that need to be updated to the 21st century. Act 32 allowed us to get monies and a, and a as Schneider as our partner to uh, develop this project and get as much bang for our buck as we could. What they realized was if they could address their deferred maintenance needs, they could spend their time thinking about how to better the learning environment. We're able to look at other programs that we wouldn't be able to look at if we wouldn't have done this. We're able to look at starting a charter school, and that charter school is for students in the autistic spectrum. To be able to do what we're doing with our students in that program would not have been happening right now if we went and done Act 32 because we would have had to put a lot of money towards the HVAC. We're now able to start really thinking about things outside of the box and other areas because we're not so focused. How are we going to get this done? How are we going to take care of this? Those aren't a part of our conversations anymore. Now it's forward thinking. Thank you.